Before we get into the video, make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe if you're new. I mean, come on, what are you doing? If you're not subbed to me by now, my content is fire from stop motions, news videos, reviews, music occasionally. All my social media accounts are linked down below. And now, let's get straight to it. What's up, you guys? Thank you for clicking on this video. So, oh man, we have some reactivate news to talk about today. More leaked characters and more leaked render designs here. So, all this news comes in via RoboGamer 1 HD here on YouTube. So, shout out to you, man. So, first up here, I want to give you guys my opinion on this Reactivate Starscream design, which is different from any other designs we've seen. There's some different color changes, some different details, such as no more asymmetrical black detailings all over him because. Allegedly, this is supposed to be his look before the invasion on Earth, which is why he looks a bit cleaner and I guess you could say more healthier here in this render as opposed to other renders we've seen of him. Um, so yeah, this looks pretty good. Definitely some, obviously, well, obviously G1 inspiration. I, I also see a, a bit of a animated um, Armada in there. So it seems like they're definitely blending a couple different styles of Starscream. And I definitely see some more of that modernized evergreen Cyberverse and Earthspark designs of Starscream within this reactivate version of the character. So this is, this is definitely pretty cool. And looking at the jet mode, which I think is like a F. 20 or an f18 or something like that and yeah this looks pretty cool um this looks like the version that is supposedly after the invasion because he got the asymmetrical black detailing there to show off that like they're low on power and they're injured and they're not healthy the transformers themselves so this is pretty cool and interesting that we're getting a, re a render for the jet mode after the invasion and then we have the pre-invasion render here for the robot mode front and back so yeah this does look pretty cool and i'm really looking forward to see what starscream's story is in the game and among this news, RoboGamer did confirm that Knockout is indeed in the Reactivate game, which you guys might remember last week I reported that uh, Is Transformers 1 trailer out on Twitter was hinting at Knockout being in the Reactivate game, so my guess was right. I'm not saying I had any insider info because I most definitely do not, but my guess was definitely right in that video. I was not clickbaiting at all, so lucky me. Me. And then the other one is Power Glide. So this is definitely new. We have not heard any leaks on Power Glide. Man, I am so excited that Power Glide is going to be in some major Transformers media again. It's been a long time. He he was in a bit of the Earth Wars or Prime Wars stuff back in the 2010s. Uh, he was in the IDW comics here and there, but he was more of like a CD list background character like 90% of the time he showed up and the only real significant role he had in Transformers media was the G1 cartoon he was in the original Marvel comics a little bit um, I don't think he was any in any of the Unicron trilogy or anything else in the 2000s I mean he did have his little appearance in the Prime Wars media in the 2010s but other than that in recent times and obviously the, the IDW comics that's it so this is really exciting news and us Transformers fans should be really hyped for this um, <laughs> I really see no reason to hit on my boy power glide he's just chilling there as a d-list character the past 30 something years so i am so glad he's coming back into the limelight somewhat here for this reactivate game hopefully in 2024 this game drops so we could get uh power glide in some recent media for the 40th anniversary as soon as possible uh but i don't know we have no idea when this game is dropping hopefully soon hopefully 2024 and if not the latest 2025 but um, yeah, that's pretty much it for the Reactivate news in this video. Super hyped for 
for Power Glide. I'm so glad he's appearing in some new media for a change. And the Starscream design does look pretty neat so far. And I hope his character is actually really nice and fleshed out for this game. Uh, let me know, let me know down in the comments below what do you guys think about this new updated design for Starscream. And how do you guys feel about Knockout and Power Glide appearing in the Reactivate game? Oh, and also, do you guys think there's going to be any sort of multiverse story going? going on you know with how popular multiverse stories have become here in the 2020s within hollywood and other sources of media with hasbro uh especially with knockout appearing in this game maybe he's from the transformers prime universe i don't know but yeah let me know down in the comments below if you guys think any multiverse storylines are going to appear in this reactivate game all my social medias are linked down below instagram tiktok twitter facebook all that good stuff my email is also down below if you all want to message me about business inquiries or if you want to hit me up about whatever or if you want to commission a diorama from me because i make dioramas for people for their stop motions photography or just regular display shelves in your home you can either hit me up on any of my social medias or just email me and we can work out a deal but yeah guys thank you for watching this video i'll catch y'all in the next one bye